One minute, everything's great and fine. The next minute, there are police everywhere, all over the bar, and people are just being grabbed and taken out. He grabbed the guy in front of me, uh, grabbed him by the shoulder, turned him around, told him that he was drunk, put him in zip tie handcuffs, and then dragged him off in front of me. They were taking someone out, and they were taking another person out, and they were slowly taking people out. I mean, people were just scrambling. Lots of confusion on what was going on. You would think that almost they had had a really bad night, and this was going to be the end of it, and they were going to take all their aggressions right here on this group of people. They had a young man pinned up against the wall. They took him to the ground, face first. They were all jumping on his limp body with their knees and elbows in the back of his neck. I had actually never seen violence like that in person before. I'm afraid. What could it, what, you know, could, are, they, are they gonna attack more people? Are they gonna target more people? Those officers took something from me on. I may never get back. They took my sense of safety and security. And they had no right to do that. And it was offensive to us to suggest that it's our fault that the violence was used against us. That we were making sexual advances and we groped an officer and we were dealt with accordingly. It sickened me because that's the blame the victim mentality. We need to do something. We need to do something today. It was very clear from all the positioning uh, of the mayor and the Fort Worth police chief that they wanted nothing to do with what happened at the Rainbow Lounge. Our goal was to stand up for ourselves as a community. I think this tragic event has created and will create so much wonderful change in the community. These are things that have all begun because of this incident. I, I hope that at some point, at the very least, we learn something. We as a city have recognized that we have some shortcomings, and we're stepping out to address those. I mean, there's nothing you can do to change that it happened, and I probably won't ever forget about it. But we just need your help to move on.